Right, here we are in the garden of Rob and Julia, who live in Regis Road, right on the Rail Hills. And uh, in their garden they've got willow trees, and uh, for quite a number of years now, they've been getting these puss moth caterpillars on the willows. And um, hopefully now I'm going to show you what the puss moths are like, except it's becoming blurred again. Um, well, well, we'll move around and see what we get. Now there's one. This one has just shed its skin. And I've been reliably informed that what it will do is turn around and eat this skin. This one's about um, half grown. It's like a very interesting looking caterpillar. And uh, we'll move around. This is the contorted willow. And we'll move around and see if we can find one or two others. Uh, which are in elusive at the moment although if we come back to that one I think you can see well done to it I think you can see that there's there's actually two there's one and there's another one just above it and there we'll move around and see if we can find some little tiny ones uh, where's that big one Bob? oh yeah here we are oh yeah this one this one's absolutely fantastic and, and this one is fully grown, or almost fully grown. And he's out here in broad daylight, so obviously no problem with predation. Um, if we can get round and have a look at the head. See what happens when we go in a bit closer. There we are. Unfortunately, I think that might be in focus. But these are absolutely fantastic. You see we clings onto the onto the little twig. And this is quite a fearsome looking creature. So the birds tend to leave them alone. Alright, this is a we're getting blurred again. I'm zooming out. This is the tree that they're on. And uh, it's not not a particularly big tree. It's but it's um, a non-native contorted willow and uh, if we go up the garden just heading up the garden here towards the garden pond and uh, hopefully we'll be able to have a look at a few tiny ones now there's houses at the back and houses all the way around so uh, it's in quite a built up area so the, the the adult moths are able to find these in gardens and here we are, I don't know whether you'll see this one but this one is so tiny have we got that one right on the on the middle part of that leaf there really tiny one and then we'll move down ah and there we are That's a real cute little fella there. And that's only about a well, quarter, quarter size. And uh, oh, that's a real nice one. I think we've got that. Let's see if I can go in a bit closer on this one without, without becoming blurred. There we are. And as you look around here, this this is the American willow, and. Um, it's been grafted onto a crack willow and when you look when you search around here you just come across more and more of them um, just looking to see if there are any eggs about because they're in all stages they've got you've got the adults uh, fully grown adults and, uh, and and we've got the eggs as well where's that uh, piece of wood uh, Julie I'll just show you this, this is um, when the moths pupate, except this this one this one hasn't hasn't touched out, or they, they, they haven't come out of this. But what they do is um, find a, a, a piece of wood or, or, or something suitable, and uh, and the moths will they'll uh, the moths will emerge in June July. Uh, obviously, there's a there's a the caterpillars of will last from last year. Whether this one will emerge now, 
it's probably doubtful. It's probably um, could have, could even could even be predated on by some parasitic wasp or something. But anyway, that's what you that's what you're looking for. Okay. Yep. Oh, and uh, yep. <laughs> Julie's just pointed out this little fella here sitting in the sunshine. Hopefully that will be relatively, relatively clear to see. I'll go in as far as I can with him, but I think we're going to get a bit, um, yeah, we're losing the focusing. Anyway, we'll leave it at that. That's just a, a taster of what these caterpillars are like and uh, absolutely fascinating. Thanks to Julia and Rob for letting us come and do this video, albeit not a very good one. <laughs>